Hello beauties, welcome back to the channel. I'm Just Kick the Dancing Avon Lady and today we're doing another mascara launch. So let's do this. So here today we have the FMG Cashmere Ultimate Volume Mascara. This was launched just a little while ago by Avon Canada and it is supposed to be a vegan mascara that's formulated with lots of great goodies in here to help give you that extreme staying power, smudge proof finish while keeping your lashes soft but not sacrificing on extreme volume. I did just finish another review on the Kathy Clatt Flare and Curl Mascara, so if you want to check that one out, click up here for that video. So why I bought this particular one is because it does have a triple sphere brush, which is very different than any other mascara brush that I have ever used. And that is to help aiding the exceptional volume or voluminous look that i would be going for with this particular one. And then the finish of this is supposed to be a glossy black, I guess as opposed to a matte black. So I am glammed up to this morning for a meeting. So I figured this is the perfect time to try out a this beauty. Another thing about this mascara is that even though it has really long lasting staying power, it's supposed to be really easy to remove. So do stay tuned to the end of the video where we're going to see did it flake throughout the day? I have a really crazy day today, so I want to see if it flakes. And then also um, how it fares with removal and how easy it is to remove. So this product here, also free from parabens, phthalates, sulfates, and gluten. So another great product if you are looking for a gluten-free beauty uh, product here. Quickly, let's go over the key ingredients. So the key ingredients of this is biotin, which helps to promote healthier lashes. It's also formulated with collagen, which is known to strengthen, hydrate, condition, and protect your lashes. Another product in it is olive-derived wax and synthetics beeswax, which will make it therefore vegan, which creates a smooth texture and increased adhesion so it stays stuck to your lashes, but it's supposed to be still easily removed. And then I might be butchering the pronunciation, Carnuba Wax, which provides a lengthening and volumizing effect. If you're looking for a healthier mascara with beneficial ingredients, this is the product for you, especially if gluten-free, vegan, cruelty-free is important to you, which cruelty-free definitely should be on everybody's list. So let's open this beauty up. I haven't read any reviews on this particular product. I haven't seen it in action. So this will be a first. Let's see this. Okay, it's black. Okay, okay, very classy, very luxe looking. It has a really nice finish to it, feels really good in the hands. This particular product is made in Italy. Okay, so we're wearing an Italian mascara today. That is a first for me, I think. Yeah, I think that's a first for me. I'm excited. I'm excited ex about seeing this triple sphere brush. So let's do this. Oh, and you can hear children's music in the background. It's Nathaniel's playlist. <laughs> oh, hello. This, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of the Marilyn Monroe building down towards Mississauga. That is so hot. It also looks like the top of the Shanghai building. So this is my lashes before I have any mascara on. I mean, they actually look pretty good today. The curl has stayed in quite well, but you know what? Mascara just finishes up a look, to be honest with you. So let's try this out. I'm gonna take off the little bit of extra. Oh, it even has less of a smell than the Kathy Cat. Now do stay tuned. Make sure you are subscribed to this channel because I have a plan to do a Avon mascara comparison video that you're not going to want to miss. So make sure you do hit that subscribe button as well as the little bell notification beside it. Let's continue on. The wand is quite chubby. It's different than what I'm used to. Okay. This is weird. It feels really, oh wow. This, Oh wow, already this one separates my lashes redonkously. I feel like it's fanning out my lashes a lot and it's really separated up. Like, holy, whoa, whoa. Okay, let's just do a quick comparison. This is with just one application. Can you not see that separation? I really, really love that. It just makes it look like I have so much more lashes because lengthwise, uh, this might be a little stereotypical, but for natural lashes, as an Asian, 
I have decently long lashes, but not a lot of volume. Nelson has gorgeous volume, voluminous lashes, but they're short. I have to say that volume, like, fanning out wise this one is hot let's do the other eye and then i'm gonna go back and do a second coat on this first eye this guys is just with one coat let's move on to a second coat i really like how well it separates it takes one step out of my makeup routine which i am always grateful for it even gets like all the little hairs okay so i don't normally do mascara on my bottom lashes but we are going to do a little bit today because i do have a full glamish face work glam that's it both sides done with two coats look at that spread <laughs> it's like we're talking about food and it's still staying fairly lifted so far first impression wise i am very very impressed i'm loving the wand it's a little bit weird to use at first because it's like it has like this this chubbiness to it that that I'm just not used to using it and so I just I think that if I play around with it a little bit it'll get better it is a fairly wet formula although because it is a brand new product I just opened it it's all it's usually I do find them they're a little bit more moist at the beginning which is always I I like it that way the dry down time it's pretty much already dry yeah there's a little bit of wetness still going on on this side but Stay tuned, I have to run to do a meeting, and then after that, I'm going to do check-ins throughout the day to see how it's lasting. See you in a bit. Oh my god, big mess, big mess over there. That can't show you that. It has been now 12 and a half hours since I've done my makeup. The mascara is still going strong. They're still actually decently lifted. I forgot to do the feel test earlier, and they're not like super stiff or anything i mean definitely like this like i said with kathy cat you can feel that there's product on it but it's not like at all i didn't notice any flaking there was a little bit of this coming off but that could also be from my eyeliner um i did get caught in the rain twice today <laughs> plus i fell asleep for a like 10 minute nap so all in all I would say that this mascara lasted really, really well. So I'm about to do a live stream and I might try to take it off during the live stream. Finished my live a little while ago and I just used the massage cream from the face shop. And look, it, it took off the majority of the mascara without any makeup remover or anything. So yeah, this is actually a decently easy mascara to remove as well. I'm quite happy with it. All right. Now back to present me. Overall, it's a really nice mascara. Like I'm really happy with how it lasted. If you uh, have any questions about this product or if you want to learn more, make sure you do click the link in the description box below. And if you have any questions about becoming an Avon Beauty Boss, make sure you do reach out to me on my other channel at Passions to Paycheck with Jessica Yick or send me an email. I love you guys so very, very, very much. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!